Yeah. Tell me about all your problems there, Frank. It's fine. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. You don't have to go away. All right, fine. Don't tell me about your problems, Frank. You can have a good one, you f Welcome, my friends. So glad you could join me. My name is Wonka, and today we're going to be playing Fishing Baron C. We're back with the most relaxing commercial fishing simulator in the whole wide world. I think I can safely say that, at least. I also think it's the only commercial fishing simulator in the world. Could be wrong on that one, though. And I know there's a few of you that enjoy this series, so I thought I would continue it with at least one more, maybe one more after this. We'll see how it goes. And if you like that idea, or you enjoyed today's episode, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. As always, if you're new here, or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. And without further ado, let's get into some big boy toys. I hope you guys enjoy, and I think you will. It's been a while, but we are back in the beautiful Barren Sea with our beautiful half boat. But this half boat has reached somewhat of an expiration. It's sad to say, well, eh, not really. I'm actually kind of excited to get rid of it finally. So we're going to go into the bank because it's a lot quieter than the crew area here. And I've done a little bit of grinding off camera to earn ourselves 3.6 million big ones. Is this my summer car? Where is this phone coming from? Oh, it's bank office noises. I get it. So anyways, we can take out an 18 million dollar or krona, however you say it, loan. We have to pay back 536,000 per month, which is easy peasy. Let's do it. That's a big loan. I don't know how we're going to ever pay all of that off. We might just have to fake our death and leave the country. That's a, that's a bridge that we can cross later. What we're going to do is get into the fun stuff. So how much is the big ol' Hermes? 19 million. We could almost get the Hermes. Super, super close. Either that or we get the Lunar Bow. Which is, which is pretty big. It's not bad. Oh, we actually have 21 million. So we could get the Hermes, but we have to travel another 87 kilometers in order to do so. I don't know how I feel about that. That's a lot, that's a lot of work, but you can at least see it. And if you want me to go for it, we could go for it in, in a future episode. There also hasn't been any real updates. I mean, there's been bug fixes and tweaks and this and that, but um, there should be some features coming soon. But in the meantime, we'll check out the Lunar Bow. We'll check out the Hermes if any cool features get added to the game. Hopefully you agree with that. This thing is still massive. You know, you gotta walk before you can run. Let's buy it. Congratulations on unlocking and purchasing your first trawler. Lunar Bow stores fish, fresh fish, in large tanks in the hull. You're not able to gut, freeze, or stack these fish, and they are sold by pumping them directly from the tanks when docking at port. Interesting, I didn't know this. You'll need at least four crew members to operate the trawling machinery on the ship. We take up the whole dock. Is this the same dock? Oh my god, we are massive. That's a big boat. We'll go into the interior and check that out soon enough but what i want to check out first is the upgrades so we got storage upgrades we got engine upgrades we got radar upgrades what is this allows you to see the distance between the trawl doors and gives you a small amount of control over their movement indicates that the net is more than 20 percent full 40 percent 60 percent 80 percent holy jeez there's a lot of funky stuff that I have no idea what it does. I am by no means a fishing expert. I'm in way over my head. So one thing I think I'm going to do though is upgrade the radar so we could find some new fish spots. I want to see exactly how big that radar is. It wasn't too expensive anyways. Maybe we'll buy this stuff as well. Might as well basically fully upgrade this thing. Maybe we'll get some engine upgrades. We'll get these two things at least. Get all the extra help we can we can get here. 
You know what? We'll do it all the way as well. We're, we're fully maxing this Lunar. Engine upgrades are expensive, but we're adding a thousand horsepower each time, so can you blame it? Um, I might do a couple, though. We'll do one at least. You know, we're going to be traveling quite a far ways. I think two is worth it. And we also need a new crew member. So, who's it going to be? None of them have a trawling skill. So that's interesting. Maybe we should get another female so our one female doesn't feel so lonely. However, I'm kind of looking for someone who's already got a pretty good stamina bar on them. I kind of like Olav here. He's not really good at anything. But his rate is 1%. This is my kind of guy right here. He works for cheap. All right, Olav, welcome to the crew. We can always fire you if you mess up. So we got Olav. Excellent. Now, how do we trawl? Does anyone, can anyone, this is, this is a learning experience. I feel like a regular, regular old Discovery Channel show, but just a little, not, not quite the like Mythbusters fun, more like more like one of those ones that have like one season and then get canceled really quick, you know, Th that kind. All right, this all seems incredibly complicated, but let's at least just drive our boat. Oh my goodness. All right, let's uh, attempt to get out of here. Wait, wait, wait. We have some kind of side things, maybe. What are what are these up here? How do we use these? Oh boy, what is this? Cycle displays. Uh. Where's my co-pilot? He's supposed to tell me. Okay, I got the controls, but I don't know which one's which here. Um, we're gonna try this one. This could be really bad. I think we're like literally against, against the dock here. How did we drift over this far? This is bull. This is a big girl. Oh, I hit just a little bit. Oh, I hit just a little bit more. Okay, okay. Forwards, 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 forwards. Okay. Please go forwards. Thank you. Okay, we're good. We're good. Don't worry whoever lives in there or works in there. I don't think anyone lives in the. Anyways. We're heading out to see what is that giant tube on the side of this thing. We got lifeboats and stuff. Oh, no, no, I'm just trying to go out to sea here, man. I think these are the trawling doors at the back here, these blue things. What are these seagulls doing? Get out of here. This thing is huge. I'm just going to get out of the, the bad spots here. Woo turns like pretty quickly I'm just gonna get out of the bad spots here but yeah we got thrusters that we can I don't really know what it does to be honest it doesn't seem to be doing much whoa it seems to be doing a little bit now holy crap <laughs> what the hell was that that was quite the impressive turn yeah, let's uh, let's get her lined up. We gotta go northwest-ish, somewhere in this general direction, and uh, let's uh, take a little walk around, I guess. So, oh my God, we got our own little office up here. I don't think we can use any of it. Oh, what? We got a captain's uniform. I don't know when that happened. We did not always have this. We are a fancy captain. That is a picture of, like, our first boat. Reminiscing on the old days. Can we go out this way? We can go out this way. That's crazy. Alright. Just make sure we're not heading for anything stupid. What is this? Can we sit here? No. This is someone else's spot. Getting a little bit of glitchy glitch over here. That's okay. A little glitchy glitch never hurt nobody, right? Off... I think I am authorized to be in here. Excuse me. I don't know how much more authorized it gets than me. Alright, this is my boat. I paid 14. I am in serious debt over this boat. Crippling amounts of debt over this boat. What are these seagulls doing? 
There's no fish here. Get out of here. Oh. Not in open water. That That's helpful. So this is where we do our trawling from. This is our trawling quarters. Ooh, we can customize our display and everything. This is just crazy. There's two phones. Who needs two chains when you got two phones? Alright, one for the crew and one for the hose. Seems seems right. What am I using to drive? Oh, a joystick. Who knew? Playing video games all this time was just prepping us to be a commercial sea captain. We should all apply and put it on our resumes. Alright, this is the work deck. It was a tube somewhere. I don't know where it went. Hello! Where are my workers? They better be hard at work. Just kidding, they're resting right now. It's fine. Can I go down here? Oh, I can go down here. I feel like I'm on the Titanic. But instead of, like, cruise ship luxuries, it's been filled with equipment for fishing. You're telling me that there's a flat ground here and I just cannot pass to those stairs. That's what you- that's what you're trying to tell me? Is this where the- the crew comes from? Probably. Look at the size of this thing. Oh my goodness. I just wanted to go onto the front of the thing and pretend like I was Jack or Leo or whatever. Pretend that I'm beautiful for like two seconds. I can't go that way either. We're, we're very restricted for such a high-powered captain who is not only the captain of the ship, but also the rightful owner. Not really quite sure. Whoa, why does this thing turn like that? <laughs> this is ridiculous. It's, <laughs> it's gonna tip. Like, I don't have... Okay, maybe I had a little bit of thruster going. But look at this. Look at that. Just ripping her sideways. Throw her into a good old drift there, why don't we? I <laughs> I think these big boats might need a little bit of work on how they handle. That should not... This thing is nimble. It's more nimble than any of the other boats that I've had. Why are these birds following me? I don't have any fish. Piss off. No. Don't argue with me. I don't have any fish. Piss off. It really doesn't seem that hard to comprehend. You stupid little shit birds, shit hawks, whatever they call you. Always chilling in fast food parking lots, looking for some stale, hard, discarded fries. That's your life. You're a garbage eater. I'm sorry, that was mean. I shouldn't. I shouldn't be so rude. You're just. You're just trying to get a little meal. And uh, look, I, I would give you some fish. I really would. Actually, funny story, when I went deep sea fishing, when we were coming back, they were gutting the fish. And um, there was a swarm of seagulls. It was like something out of a damn movie. I thought, I thought we were, I thought we were going to get attacked. There was enough of them in numbers that they could have started, like, dive bombing us and we, we probably would have had to duck for cover. I think I have a recording of it somewhere on some hard drive or computer that's lost in storage somewhere. So this isn't full engine power. Uh, there was one more tier up, but we're doing 30 knots, which is definitely faster than any boat that we've been in so far. And it's bigger than any boat that we've been in so far. So think about that as far as engines go for a couple seconds. Honestly, most boats in this game, I really like the inside camera, but not this one. You don't get to see much, although we could cycle these displays. Let's see what we got here. We got temperature. Is that temperature of the boat, or is that temperature of the water? Oh, we do have the sonar as well. Speaking of which, how much... Oh my god! <laughs> this was the little stream of sonar that I was doing on my old boat, on the little half boat. 
And uh, this is the stream of sonar we're doing right now. It's almost like the size of the circle. Maybe like this big of the original circle. This is the radius. So if you take from the middle of our boat here to the edge of the circle and go around, that's what we're covering. It's pretty damn close to the size of this circle. <laughs> that's insane. Let's take a peek. Have we found any? Oh, look at us. Finding all kinds of fish and spots. Showing up like acne on a preteen. Look at this. I really like our captain's uniform. I wish I could look myself in the mirror or something. And just say, hey. You. You, you good looking man right there. You made it. You done made it. Why is this boat so ridiculous? I have no idea why the steering is like that. Has nobody made it to this boat yet and realized, like, hey, you guys should probably fix this a little bit. It's a little silly. Is that just, a, no, just me? It's fine, I mean, to each their own. So let's just see what we do here, the crew. So we got a set trawl, and then I guess once we have the fish, we haul the trawl? I'm not sure. Why are there... Oh, we could have seven crew uh, on this here ship. I guess we should get our professional chef to work prepping the food for this here ship. I don't know why we've gone down to like 20 knots. We were doing like 30 before. What the hell changed? Is the wind going against us now? You know a game I can't get out of my head? Wreckfest. I really want to play Wreckfest. It looks like so much fun. I just want to get T-boned in a figure eight. Or T-bone someone in a figure eight. Looks like a lot of fun. If someone comments in the comment section and says, Do it. I might let the peer pressure get to me. Why do I keep getting turned around north? I do not want to go north. And why <laughs> does this boat handle like crap like absolute crap all the other boats actually felt pretty good and then I got my hands on this thing look seagulls I know my boat is tasty and delicious looking and a thing of absolute beauty look at it majestically going through the water with its rear end really low and its front end was really high and now it's sinking back into the water. I don't know what's going on with this boat and I don't know why you're following it and looking up to it like it's an idol but um, you probably should, should just get a life seagulls you're annoying the hell out of me yeah tell me about all your problems there Frank it's fine, no 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 it's fine it's fine, you don't have to go away, alright fine don't tell me about your problems, Frank. You can have a good one, you fuck. So when do I get the symbol that I'm in open water? Someone give me the signal. Does like a thumbs up just appear in the sky? In lights? Does a plane fly by with a banner that says, You're good to go! What happens here? Do the seagulls stop following me? Is that the tell? The seagulls are like, Oh, screw that, bro! Land is too far away. What if you're a seagull and you're flying out into the water like this because you're chasing a boat that you think has fish on it and then all of a sudden you realize that you're tired. Or you're getting a little tired at least. And uh, land is pretty far. Can seagulls float? Find out. Now this is an animal planet. I haven't quite discovered my discovery show type. Oh, oh. What is this? Is this... Oh, it's just a whale. I thought you were a buoy signaling open water. I'm just disappointed now. Do you like my new boat, though, my whale friends? The water is either very calm or just, like, it doesn't affect a boat of this size at all. We're doing 38 knots now. I don't know how... What determines... What is that? Is that the open water ship? I thought there wasn't an open water ship. Alright, Captain's update. Still kind of looks like a ship. Still not quite sure what the hell it is, though. 
the seagulls seem to have their opinions. I'm not quite sure myself if I trust them. Oh, we are way past that open water ship. <laughs> We're all the way over here. So I don't know what the heck this thing is. Is this the edge of the map? Are we about to uh, experience some uh, interesting glitchiness? I don't know, but I want to see what this map is, or this boat thing is. See, I got confused that that ship emblem that's way back there was this ship signifying the open water, I guess. I guess I was extremely wrong. Ooh, that boat makes me look kind of small. It's a big boat. What? What is this? Is this open water? This looks like ice water. Is this ice water? This is 100% ice. Can I go through it? Uh-oh, uh-oh, didn't mean to turn that hard into it. We just kind of want to test the waters here. We don't want to do too much. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh. All right, so uh, welcome to the edge of the world where ice will mess you up big time. I still am unable to back away from this ice. Not quite sure what to do here. I may or may not be sinking or stuck on some ice. Are we reversing at all? Yeah, I think we are. So, uh, what the hell? Where's the open water? What? Oh my god, I'm hitting like small iceberg things. This is, this is not good. I'm at 48%. 46% I cannot get out of here please stop I don't want to be stuck on these things anymore oh my god I drove all the way out here and I'm just gonna sink my brand new ship can these thrusters do something cuz I'm getting the feeling they do a lot of nothing um, can I put a crew member on repair to try and counter this I don't think it's gonna help me much this is probably where we die everyone Thanks for, uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the trawling that we did not do. Uh, oh! Your boat is sinking. You should call the rescue service. Help. 16 million? Sure. You have been towed back to port and your boat has been repaired and refueled. Please be more careful. Unfortunately, you don't have 16 million to pay for the rescue. So the rescue company has agreed to loan you the money with an interest rate of 5%. You will need to pay back 1 million, 1.4 million monthly for the next 12 months. Oh my God. What the hell? Someone's on a lifeboat. Oh, well, that must have been the rescue boat. Either that or my crew just jumped ship. I would too. Look at them go. They're quick. They want to race? Let's do it. No, they're going to win. Or will they? Or will they? This is the greatest race of all time. And I'm losing. Hey, how do I have $18 million right now? They loaned me $18 million, But then they didn't take the 18 million you know i'm starting to think that this might have been the best thing that ever happened to me the whole hitting the iceberg thing not in open water <clears throat> let me just show you exactly where i am um you see that that's the ship that says open water and i am in the vicinity so um what I'm curious to know is, where the hell is open water? What the hell? Look at all this stuff. How are you su How is any normal person supposed to navigate this? Where the hell is open water? I had to definitely look it up, but I figured it out. Right here, this elusive little thing. Go to open water. Here we are in open water. You can't see land any which way. We actually don't have a map. So this is where we needed to be. Now we're gonna slow down a little bit here and we're gonna uh, head on back 
t to this thing. I don't even know what most of those things mean, so I'm not even going to bother with that. What I need to do is set the trawl net. So now we're setting the, the net. Okay. Unable to adjust wire length until the net is at least 20 meters out. Use the arrow keys to control the trawl doors. The arrow keys. Right and left. Open, close, I don't even know. I have no idea what I'm doing here. Things are definitely happening. Um, how do I know where the fish are? Port, starboard, are these the fish? Should I be dropping the, these down? I don't see any numbers doing anything different as I do this. They're just steady going the exact same way the whole time. Oh, we're at... Okay, we're at the bottom, I think, pretty much now. So we have to actually reel it in. I think if you see here, our doors are at the bottom of the ocean here. That's not good. I don't think we want to be dragging those off the bottom of the ocean. So I think we start reeling those in, and they should hopefully start coming back up. I have no idea. I don't know what this is. I don't know what any of that is. I just need to call for help here. Um, do we set the crew to hauling now? Oh, I was supposed to reel in this one as well. I only reeled in the first one. This one's probably good roughly where it is. I have no idea. I'm trying to reel up that other door right now. I think we just lost it. I think we just lost one of our doors. Oh! Is that it? Is that it? We got it. It's it's alive. Our trawl door is alive. Now they're going off the screen though. What's What's happening? It looks like there's some schools maybe up here. Wherever our doors are heading to. Oh, and we're getting some fish here. We're at 40%. That's that's something. Maybe we need to Oh my god, I keep leaving this chair. Holy crap! We're we're in something here. Let's uh maybe aim a bit to the left and down. If that's a thing. Holy crap, look at all the fish. Can we get into that? What the hell is going on? Is that fish? We're at 40% fish. Caught, I think. <laughs> This is so much more confusing than all of the other methods of fishing. <laughs> I can tell you that much. Oh my god, how many times am I going to hit the wrong frickin' button here? I have no idea what is going on, but I think we're catching more stuff. So that's... That's something, right? So we're getting full. Things are beeping at me, I think. How do we reel it in? I guess we uh, tell the crew to start hauling it. Hey crew, haul trawl. Let's go, people. Haul the trawl. Look at look at the rush, the spring in their step. They really want to keep their jobs. I don't know why that's red. I don't know. I don't like that. Can I stop catching things? I mean, I guess reel in port wire is what we want. I'm just gonna keep doing that, I guess, until it's 25 meters from the ship. No idea. Oh, I see one of the doors there. I think. I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but I see it. Here we go. Haul in trawl net. Oh, we did it. My ears, they feel so much better. Oh my god, look at it go. They're just hauling it in. Holy fish! Is that... Is that where you're gonna keep them? Is that it? You just... That's a lot of fish. Are you done? Pump fish. Oh, it's, it's done. Where did they go? 
Holy robotic arm and everything. What is this ship? Okay, let's drive. That's it? That's all we got? I mean, it's a pretty good amount, but it's not like a full... A full thing by any means. So we'd have to do that... Probably two more times. If not three more times. But I don't have the time to do that. So what we're gonna do... Is just go see how much one... Horribly done... <laughs> net trawl can sell for. Uh, we won't go all the way back to Hammerfest. We'll actually just skate this skinny little passageway here. That trawling is extremely confusing and hard to understand. But I think I eventually might have got it. How did she get too tired to work? What is she working on? They're just sitting there. All right, into port we go with a good amount of fish, but not obviously as much as we could we could ideally carry. So let's dock it. We got a lot of mackerel, which is the f a new fish that we could not catch before. You can only catch it through trawling. And let's see how much we've sold it for. Holy Moses, that's almost two million. And I didn't even try. If I sat there and tried for the other two, let's say two more on the low end. That's six million right there. We could pay this thing off in no time. No time. And we already have 20 million, so we could just buy the Hermes with that <laughs> and uh, see what happens when we don't pay our debts, you know? Get a little life lesson that way, maybe. But that's going to be it for this episode. If you guys want one more, if you want me to keep an eye out for the updates coming this, w this game's way... Do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. And remember what we have to rely on, net profits. Take her easy. Make sure you hit that like button, because if you guys hit the like button for me, lots of good things happen, okay? And we can grow and do giveaways and, like, subscribe and all that good stuff, okay? Take her easy. <laughs>